Hey, ladies and gentlemen, I don't know if you know somebody called Jeffree Star. <laughs> He's a, she's a, whatever you want to call it, LGBTQ star and everything. But some of them just speak sense. Like, literally, they do exist. They're just not very vocal because they don't really care about the political battle. But now, she had something to say. I'm not into all the other bullshit, I think. What other bullshit? The they, um, the they and them. Yeah. And all that extra shit that we added during the pandemic because everyone mm. was so bored on their houses. They just started to make up more shit and more, more shit. stuff. More stuff. Yeah. yeah. That's why the conservatives like me because I'm just real. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, you There's do no have a conservative you're vibe to you. Them. You're trans, you're male, or you're female. And you're standing and on that. Get so mad when I say that. Mm -hmm. How are you with they? What the f that mean? <laughs> <laughs> stupid is what it is. Yeah. Yeah. But you need someone like me that looks like me to say it. Because mm -hmm. if you say it, it turns into you're homophobic. You hate trans people. You hate gays. And it's just how you feel. You don't hate anyone. You just <laughs> think it's stupid. Yeah, yeah. I could sit here. I could sit here comfortably on camera and say, like, I, I truly just don't understand it. Yeah, and that's okay. But that's as far as I can go. Yeah. It doesn't but mean you're for, hateful. Yeah. And then you, like you said, like you are the perfect vessel for this type of situation. Yeah. You are you steam in that? Are you making sure that people know? Hey, listen, no, there are I, no days in them. A lot about it because I I love doing certain things like in the gun world or like you know, and I go to a lot and do a lot of podcasts for things that are not beauty related. And I think mm. that's what's fun. And of course, the whole mafia is going after her, and she had to make a new video. And I'm like, hey, people, you gotta chill. You saw what she said. It's just that I just don't understand. You just keep creating more labels. The more time you invest in it, the more you create, you have more reason to be angry. And then you blame more people. And everybody's like, yo, I feel disgusted. Then even your own has to put a line like, yo, um, I just want to talk. That doesn't mean I hate you because I disagree with you. But guess what? Most of my friends, we disagree on something. But... They don't want that to exist. You have to accept them perfectly. Even if you fake it, that's wrong. You actually have to believe what they believe. I can't believe what you are. <laughs> you are what you are. That's it. Um, so to anyone that is trying to make it seem like I said that non-binary people don't exist, I never said that. Record this right now. Never said it. You're putting words in my Fact. mouth. I said I don't like the pronouns and I don't agree with them. I never said that they don't exist. I'm a freak. I'm a part of the LGBT community. I'm pansexual. I'm bisexual. Whatever the fuck you want to call me. I Simple. don't like labels. I like guys. I like girls. I like sleeping with both. But I love men. Whatever you think that it that means to you, bitch. I don't care. Label it however you want. But don't put words in my mouth. I do not agree with a few things. I'm old school. This new, all these fucking 30 terms, girl, stop. Stop complicating everything. Yeah. Just chill. Take yeah. a hit. Relax. And don't put words in my mouth. Maybe a pee pee. What we're not going to do is say I'm against the LGBTQ community. Are you kidding me, bitch? That's what I am. <laughs> you don't have to agree with certain names, labels, and things. And then all of a sudden, I'm labeled something. It's an endless cycle, you guys. I get it. It's just funny. I've been a part of this game a long time. Mm. Um, I'm definitely have been way more active. Bitches awake. I'm posting every day. I feel amazing. Um, so I think people are like, oh, Jeffrey's being a little more mouthy. No, bitch, I'm just being me. I'm doing interviews. I'm back. I'm back out, Miss Girl. Um, and we had an amazing time at Super Bowl weekend. The podcast is getting amazing views. Thank you guys for listening. And there was way more said than just that. And what the f is this? <laughs> and I think it's funny. He, she, whatever, they made a good point. It's a freaking podcast. They only pick one place, one thing, and they use that just to shame gangster, prove a point, model points. Yeah, I feel like a victim, one more. Uh, and that's it. That's the, that's, the, that, that's the thing. Like, their purpose is identify and feel that they get hated and they're winning and they're pointing fingers. I think that is a very horrible life. <laughs> because I can do that too. But I just know it's a waste of time. But anyway, you do it. I'm glad we have more people on the other side calling it out. And I don't freaking care that she's conservative. Because just because you make sense, that doesn't mean you're conservative. Just because you can talk fast, that doesn't mean that you're freaking liberal. I don't care. Let people be. I miss the days that when I know somebody is a horrible person, I can just say, that's a horrible person. He hates black people. That's it. He jokes, he teases me. That's it. And I know it's horrible, 
but at least I know who's horrible. Now we have all these transformers hitting between us and I don't know who is who. But anyway, short video. I, I, short, I know I talk too much sometimes. But anyway, let me know what you guys think. Like, share and the usual and see you guys next time. Peace.